Hi, hello, my dear students. Welcome to our channel, Rajesh Biology, and I'm Rajesh MSC Chuvalachi. So, the today our topic is molecular basis of inheritance. So, before starting the session, let me check: is our session is started or not, and is my voice is clear or not? First, okay, right. Yeah, the session is just started, and Rup Mahesh, good evening. Uh, is my voice is clear? Yes, voice is also clear. Thank you for the like, Rup Mahesh. And um, here is the uh, small introduction about our app Rajesh Biology, which is available in uh, Google Play Store. You can download this for free. And in this also, so many free content is there, free videos and uh, free courses, free tests, free study material. Lacks of questions are there. And along with that, few are paid content is also present and paid tests are also available. Um, come to the first question. Here it is the first question. That is, um, the DNA was first identified by who is the scientist identified first the DNA. And in our app Rajesh Biology, there is a um, great study material is available. Like a PPTs, practice test, ranker test series, full syllabus, neat grand test, old question papers, biology, chemistry. Okay. Yeah, Gnaneshwari. Gnaneshwari says uh, Watson. If Watson identified the first, what about the Crick? Watson and Crick, they both uh, get the Nobel Prize for the double helical structure of the DNA. Actually, they are not first identified the DNA. Before Watson and Crick also, DNA is identified. Okay, they just explain the structure of the DNA as a double helical structure. Yes, Saparna party one day, right? Mishar. Mishar is the scientist first who identified the DNA structure. Come to the second question. The process of copying genetic information from one strand of DNA into the RNA. Yes, um, what it is called? The process of copying genetic information from one strand of DNA. Non-coding strand most, most right it is. Strand of DNA into the RNA. What it is called? Whether it is the translation, replication, transformation or transcription. Yeah, Jnaneshwari, Chandrika, you all write. Very good. The right answer is a transcription. Simply we can remember description, prescription. Doctor write prescription, right? So writing is the scription. It is writing. That written part, mRNA, is translated into the protein. Another language. Protein is another language. Amino acid is another language. That is translation. One language to another language. So if a doctor is a DNA, and prescription note is RNA, the process is transcription, prescription. And that a medical shop become ribosome, which is translated into the medicines. That medicines are amino acids. Like that we can remember, first transcription, then translation. Yes, now come to the third question. DNA replication takes place in which phase of the cell cycle? Very important it is. DNA replication takes place in which phase of cell cycle? Here the topic wise weightage is there regarding to the biology, chemistry and physics. Chapter wise weightage. And this weightage is prepared based on the 2023 NEET examination paper. Okay. And within 29 days, uh, I think we have the NEET exam. Come to the third question. Yes, third one. Yeah, Chandrika and Aparna Patibanda, first of all. Next, Chandrika, Janeshwari, you all right? Yes phase. The name itself indicates yes means a synthesis. Synthesis phase. Come to the fourth question. Yeah, Chandrika. Uh, Chandrika says 14th. Actually, this is the fourth question. 14th, 4. Janeshwari also says 4. In uh, Meselson and uh, Stahl experiment, heavy DNA distinguished from the normal DNA by centrifugation in which density gradient medium. Yeah, Aparna Patipanda, you are right. It is a CSCL, not uh, both one and two. It is, a, the answer is, right answer is three. Come to the fifth question. Taylor and his colleagues performed experiments on uh, Visia Feba using Visia Feba. Taylor and his colleagues performed experiments. 
in our app Rajesh Biology, there is some study planners are also available. You can uh, follow the study plans if you like, if you feel they are better. And uh, in this PPT, BMSR PPT, 18th March, uh, there is a analysis, chapter wise analysis from the last few years NEET examination, which chapter, from which chapter they, they give more questions and which topic they focused more like that. Yeah, uh, radioactive thymidine, correct. Aparna Patipanda. And um, yes, Chandrika, right? Very good. And Chandrika gives the right answer for the sixth question also. Correct formula of Charga fruit A plus G is equal to T plus C. Perfect. How many adenine and guanines are there? Equal number of thymine and cytosines are present. Correct. Excellent. So, yes, sixth one is uh, one. Ganesh Pari and Chandrika, you are right. Come to the seventh question. The percentage of guanine is 18 in a double strand DNA molecule. The percentage of guanine is 18 in a double standard DNA molecule. Okay. What would be the percentage of thymine? What would be the percentage of thymine? So 18, 25 minus 18, we, say, we do like that. 2 plus 7. Yes, the right answer is how many guanine? The percentage of guanine is 18. Automatically, the uh, cytosine is also 18. Okay, in 100, 18 plus 18. How much it is? 18 plus 18 means 36. If we remove, uh, if we less the 36, what is the remaining number? The 4 and uh, yes, here the 9 minus 64. 64, in this 64 also, half, 64 by 2. So the total 32. The right answer is 4. Seventh option is a 4. Who gave the first right answer? Yes, Saparna Patibanda, right? And the remaining members are wrong. Very good, Chandrika, right? Yes, Gnaneshwari, right? Super. Let's come to the eighth question. Yeah. The unequal proof that DNA is the genetic material given by which experiment and performed using? Yeah. Chandrika says uh, Nizlan and uh, Stahl using bacteria. But no. Uh, what is the right answer? Can I guess the right answer from the Gnaneshwari or Aparna Patibanda? Yeah, Gnaneshwari says uh, transforming principle using bacteria. That is also wrong. Actually, the right answer is uh, Harshay Chase using bacterial virus. First one is the right answer. Come to the ninth question. Here, these are the different mock tests we have in our app. Biology today makes sense we have in our app. Yes, Nyaneshwari, right? Come to the ninth question. Length of DNA is affected by the which is going to decide the length of the DNA. The students who are in a live session uh, try to invite your friends also. Uh, by sharing this link in your WhatsApp statuses or in WhatsApp groups. If your friends are also written for this, uh, it becomes more interesting. Yeah, ninth question. Nobody gives the right answer. Actually, the nitrogen bases are going to decide the length of the DNA. Yes, Chandrika, no, it is uh, not a pitch. It is the nitrogen bases. Yes, correct, Aparna. Let's come to the 10th question. Histones are rich in. Histones are rich in. So, let me say the right answer. Both lysine and arginine both are present. Right answer is 4. Yes, Nyaneshwari. Very good. Come to the 11th question. 
in double stranded dna in double stranded dna there is an equal proportion of purines and pyrimidines pitch of the helix is 3.4 nanometers ya yeah, preeti you are right for the 10th question come to the right answer for 11th question welcome preeti 11th question the two strands run parallel in a uh, 5 to 3 direction and guanine is bonded with thymine by three hydrogen bonds definitely the fourth one is wrong yes perfect chandrika you are right pitch of the helix is 3.4 nanometers come to the yeah gnaneshwari and aparna very good everybody come to the 12th question read it read the following statements and choose the correct option two nucleotides are linked through phosphodiester bond okay two nucleotides are linked through phosphodiester bond so no i think it is so nitrogen base is a linked to pento sugar by n acetyl n glycosidic linkage n glycosidic linkage is correct and thymine is also referred to as 5 ethyl uracil no i think yes who says the right answer no gnaneshwari says 2 b c d presence of thymine confers additional stability to dna presence of thymine confers additional stability to dna right yes gnaneshwari you are good uh, good uh, guess after i say the answer and very good aparna patimanda this is nucleic acid uh, nucleotides are formed by the phosphodiester bond that is wrong come to the next question 13th question in our app rajesh biology you can find the video lectures also for free yeah dinesh jetta please welcome very good i'm just kidding gnaneshwari come to here the 13th question A typical nucleosome contains how many base pairs of DNA helix? One nucleosome. One nucleosome contains. Yeah, Gnaneshwari and. Uh, Jetta. So the right answer is two hundred base pairs. Correct. Everybody right. Ganesh Pari, Dinesh Jetta, Aparna, and uh, Chandrika. Come to the fourteenth question. Match the column one with the suitable terms in column two. Bacterial phase mRNA processing. caps uh, capsid sir capsid uh, transposons splicing protein coat okazaki fragments viruses dna with uh, switching position dna so try to match this the 14th question bacteriophages are actually the viruses so definitely the right answer is between the first and two not three dinesh capsid capsid definitely as per the fourth option any of these two automatically capsid is 3 protein coat and the c is deciding factor which is the right answer in between these two yeah chandrika you are right the right answer is 2 So C one splicing mRNA processing and D five Okazaki fragments uh, or DNA. Okay, and DNA with the switching position is a transposons. The right answer is two. Let's come to the fifteenth question. In our app Rajesh Biology, there is a short term course in that. I explained six chapters, six different topics. That is, thing the mammalia, animal diversity, 
and uh, sorry animal tissues and kingdom animalia earthworm human reproduction reproductive health and the genetics up to the morgan experiments according to this there is um, a clear explanation of all these concepts according to the ncrt and uh, doubt clearing sessions are there and daily and weekend tests are available and the topic wise previous questions we discussed in every in every slide okay and uh, there is a uh, notes and mind maps three grand tests are available okay so these are the things now come to the 15th question the students who are interested to join they can join in this course uh, and uh, if you feel that money the price is more i already provide this price only for uh, the 500 rupees by giving 400 rupees uh, discount uh, so the students who want to join if they send a personal message in app i'll provide you the coupon a special coupon for you now come to the 15th question rna polymerase 1 transcribes which of the following rna that is rrna 15th one first it is given by the dinesh very good aparna and the gyaneshwari now come to the 16th question how many codons are for different types of amino acids 61 okay so the right answer is given by the for the first time Ganeshwari very good and come to the 17th question RNA polymerase binds which of the following factors to terminate a transcription to terminate transcription RHO so the 17th four option given by the Dinesh and Ganeshwari very well done excellent now come to the 18th question Statement 1. RNA polymerase are present only in nucleus. 16th, sorry, 18th question. RNA polymerase is, are present only in nucleus. That is the 18th question. Statement 1. Is that correct? Statement 2. RNA polymerase catalyze only process of elongation. So... The right answer is, who are going to say the right answer? Only the statement 2 is correct. Yes, Dinesh, very good, excellent. Now come to the 19th question. Aparna, right? 19th question. Identify A, B, C and D for the given diagram. which is a coding strand which is a non-coding strand which is a terminator which is template strand which is 3 to 5 and which is a 5 to 3 and yeah Aparna and Gnaneshwari you said very well A is a 3 to 5 and 3 and 5 and and it is B is the 5 and 3 and and it is only the coding strand okay so it becomes a template strand and here it is the terminator come to the 20th question rna polymerase 3 transcribes rna polymerase 3 transcribes rrna trna hnrna and all of these yeah gnaneshwari very good the right answer is TRNA, transcription RNA. Dinesh, very good. And the upper na you are right. Come to here. It is a small video related to the app. How to attempt the free test in our app. Nearly more than 20 plus t free tests are available in our app. It is really an extraordinary, amazing experience you can feel. You never feel regret after attempting at least a single test. And you are so much enthusiastic to attempt the remaining tests also. In this, when you click on the left upper corner on the three bars, a side menu will open. In that, the fourth option is the free test. And if you are going to attempt the test, in this also it shows how much time is remaining and how many marks for each question and the negative marking minus one also and at that time if you click this uh, i symbol that is for the review that means if any question is there at that time you are confused and you don't want to waste your time with that question further at that time if you click on that i symbol you can move to the next question 
before submitting it shows you these are the questions you marked for the review and go check it once like that once you check once you submit it shows you how many questions you are attempted how many questions you left how many questions for the review is selected and everything still if you submit uh, within how much time you completed the exam how many marks you get and how many members attempted and what is our rank and what is the solutions everything it is going to explain within fraction of minutes so it is really an amazing experience with uh, along with the solutions you will get okay yeah thank you thank you so much dinesh jetta uh, with our support only all this is possible without your support without subscribers uh, i cannot do this type of uh, acts thank you so much for supporting me from the beginning so i think dinesh jetta means um, uh, your name you are a writer bhavani i think so come to the 21st question which is not true about uh, splicing no it is not uh, it was uh, dinesh uh, uppari maybe bhavani means dinesh with this name uh, two subscribers i have previously yes 21st which is not true about the splicing entrants are removed and exons are joined in a defined order exons are removed and entrants are joined in a defined order uh no the rest it is are not uh, one the right answer is exons are removed and entrants are joined in a defined order the right answer is two you are ganesh kuri and aparna padpanda you both are correct come to the 22nd question which of the following is not a stop codon yes very important you should know all the stop codons and you should know what is not a stop codon also there is three stop codons among the four you have to find out the codon which is not a stop codon 22 ya gnaneshwari you are right ugu is not a stop codon uga uaa uag are the stop codons aparna right and dinesh right come to the 24th question it is also very important which codon performs dual function 23 yes perfect august aug uh, yes aparna patipanda right so here it is going to work like a starting codon and methionine coding when i said methionine is also formed from that now come to here in this question uh, here what is 1 what is 2 what is 3 24th question Twenty three four correct. Now come to the twenty fourth question. Yes, Aparna. One is replication, two is transcription, another one is translation, and the central dogma is uh, proposed by the Francis Crick. Excellent. Uh, super. So twenty fourth two is the right answer. Come to the twenty five. Which of following is correct regarding the genetic code? Yeah, Ganesh, very right. Twenty-five. Which of the following is correct regarding genetic code? Yes. Triple U is a initiation codon, which also supports for phenylalanine. Is it wrong? Triple U is not at all initiation codon. and there are 64 triplet codons and only 20 amino acids is right so the right answer is 25 to come to the 26th question which is true about ribonucleic acid which is true about ribonucleic acid rna cannot generate its replica yes aparna correct come to the 26th rna cannot generate its replica 26th rna mutate at very slow rate rna is highly reactive and catalytic 
and RNA is more stable due to the presence of uracil. Vardhan. Yeah, good evening, Vardhan. I'm fine, thank you. How about you? Yeah, Vardhan, I am from Hospet, uh, Karnataka near Hampi. You are? Come to the 26th question. Yes, the right answer is uh, RNG is highly reactive and catalytic. Who said the right answer 26? No, nobody. Come to the 27th question. I am from Ballari. Okay. Uh, so, Ballari Chaitanya College. You are? Identify the incorrect pair. E. coli 4.6 into 10 to the power of 6 uh, base pairs. Correct only. And deployed human DNA is equal to 6.6 into 10 to the power of 9 base pairs. It is also right. Okay. And now you are in uh, second year. So, how is your uh, studies? 27 so the right answer is the fourth answer because it is wrong yes Dinesh correct come to the 28th 28th question select the true or false for the following statements and choose the correct option true or false we have to say according to this question so the first one is definitely true because in all options true is there no need to read and don't waste your time for reading the first statement come to the second statement if it is a false you can eliminate one free 2oh of rna makes it more liable and easily degradable is this right see your lecture class thank you so much yes thank you 10th class will have more interaction. Okay, okay, we're done. So you are in 10th class. Okay. Thank you so much for attending the session. Actually, this uh, topic is related to the second year intermediate biology. So after completion of your 10th, uh, we are going to join in which group? PCMB or PCMC? Yes, now come to the 28th. Uh, the right answer is... Uh, no, it is not 4, it is 1. Yeah. Badraksh. Welcome, Badraksh. Thank you for attending this session. Yeah, by PC. Very good. Excellent. So, be in contact with me. Yeah. Try to download the app Rajesh Biology. You can regularly message in that. Wherever you get the doubt in the subject biology, you can uh, free to ask me in our app Kalyan Durgam near uh, border okay okay so you know this host pet Hampi and Ballari very good yeah Badraksh you are from uh, IPC first year okay Badraksh you are from where 29th question uh, just I get a notification as a new person is downloaded the app Nagaraju. Thank you, Nagaraju, for downloading the app. Hyderabad, okay. Come to the 29th question. Let me check the answer who gives. Yes, Nyaneshwari, you are right. The Mizlan and the Stal, which is already a repeated question, I think. Come to the 30th question. Yeah, Nyaneshwari, you are right. actually, now I am staying in Karnataka. Uh, Karnataka host paid. but AP I am come from uh, this uh, East Godavari district my proper is East Godavari district in Andhra Pradesh yes very good Badraksh it is better to prepare from now onwards for the NEET examination okay so try to attend the live sessions related to the MCQs 
and uh, i already completed so many concept all the concepts from the first year test book the practice test 1 2 practice test uh, 16 or practice test 15 they are completely related to the first year biology and crt you can um, uh, watch that type of videos and uh, try to solve that questions first year topics only these are the second year yeah definitely definitely vadraksh uh, but uh, when i have the free time i'm going to explain i already completed the chapter reproduction now i have to begin the reproductive health in that uh, app so when i have the free time when the neat examination is over uh, automatically i become somewhat free in that free time i'll do the many videos come to the 30th question aparna no it is wrong actually it is uh, the right answer is 1 so a3 jacob and monad is apparent and uh, b5 uh, alex jeffrey carissa is uh, this uh, dna fingerprinting yes it is very easy b5 alex jeffrey dna fingerprinting so based on this b5 we can automatically conclude the remaining all okay so e is uh, for viruses coat only capsid it is called one gene one enzyme that is uh, neurospora and uh, nirenberg self resistor and it is very easy alex jeffrey is related to the dna fingerprinting and very important alex jeffrey uh, when we are in pg one girl one of my uh, classmates uh, take this uh, chapter uh, to explain at that time uh, the name is uh, noted in my minds like jeffa alex jeffrey so i'm not uh, describing i'm not uh, blaming the scientist or any other person but to remember dna fingerprinting scientist the word brahmanandam which is used by the brahmanandam for several times jeff if you remember that jeffrey we simply remember come to the 31st question yeah thank you yeah thank you so much vadraksh to watch my videos uh, um come to the 31st a b dna molecule completes one turn after every after every a b dna molecule not ab a b dna molecule completes one turn after every how many base pairs it is very easy question it completes one turn after how many base pairs it is one turn for one turn yes it is not eight base pairs gnaneshwar it is 10 base pairs very easy it is and very important also one pitch means one turn in every pitch 10 base pairs are there if it is 34 angstroms 3.4 angstroms are there like that yes 31 to right aparna come to the 32 v and t r size varies from v and t r size is vary from yeah it is vary from 0.1 to 20 kb yes 32 to 1 is the right answer 33 so dna molecule act as a template for synthesis of both dna and rna correct it is uh, perfect because the, it is only act like a template for both the synthesis of dna replication and in the form of uh, uh, transcription rna correct dna double helix helix has a feature of right handed coiling which alone confers stability to dna actually the dna left hand side so the assertion is correct but the reason is false come to the 34 regulation of gene expression occurs at various levels in eukaryotes regulation of gene expression occurs at various levels in eukaryotes so what is the sequence that is fourth question gene primary transcript splicing mrna translation or protein is this correct or primary transcript gene mrna splicing translation protein or translation protein is uh, common here also gene is also common so after gene mrna or after gene uh, primary transcript if it is a primary transcript after that uh, splicing or the gene 
So if we compare like that, the right answer for this is the one. Gene primary transcript splicing mRNA translation and protein. No, it is not Trignaneshwari. Come to the 35. In lac operon gene, Y, Z, I, A, code for what? Y is code for what? Z is code for what? And I and A. It is very important repeated question. You should know everything about the lac operon concept, which is very important. 35. Yeah, uh, Badraksh, you are from where? That means uh, your district and your place. Come to the 35. 35, the right answer is a 2. Uh, yes, Nyaneshwari, very good. 36. Um, Ganeshwari says uh, right answer that is lactose. The inducer for switching on and off, switching on and off of the lac operon is lactose. Perfect, Ganeshwari. You are well prepared from this uh, important topic, lac operon. 37. Match the codons with their coded amino acids and choose the correct option. A is 3. So definitely second option is wrong. So, who is going to say the right answer for the 37th question? They will definitely get very good marks. Who know the... Who know better about this uh, genetic code? This is also very important concept from the molecular base of inheritance. Very important. Total 64 codons, which is going to form 20 amino acids. 37th question. The right answer is. Okay, I'll reveal that triple U is going to form the phenylalanine. It is known by Patibanda, I think. So B4, it is definitely not 3 also. No, it is not 1, Ganeshwari, it is options. Four is the right answer okay so UGU is going to control the system and the triple G is going to control the glycine 38 yes Dinesh and Ganeshwari right come to the 38th question which is true for the translation UTRs are present before the stop quota Translation begins when large subunit of the ribosome encounters an mRNA and for terminating translation a release factor binds to start and stop codon and the right answer is the ribozyme catalyzes the formation of peptide bond. 39th question. Methyl guanosine trans, uh, triphosphate. Methyl guanosine triphosphate is related to 39th question. It is related to what? It is related to the capping. Uh, come to the 40th question. Yes, 33. Correct. Nanashpuri and Aparna Patipanda. Click on your screen, right side of your screen for several times. Then you will reach the current question. We are completing the question number 40. Yes, uh, Ganeshwari, the question number 40, the right answer is um, option 1. A is uh, A to B, that is a 3 to 5, and uh, C is a template strand, and D leading strand, and E lagging strand. It is very easy question. E lagging and uh, D leading. Okay. Come to the question number 41. Yes, Ganeshwari, very good. Statement 1, the functions are unknown for over 60% of the discovered genes. And Chandrika is not going to give the answers for this. Uh, is Chandrika present? Statement 2. Less than 2% of the genome codes for. Statement 2. 
So I'll uh, read the questions. Change your quality advanced like 720 pixel or 480 pixel if there is no clarity. Okay. Now come to the question number 41. 41.3 Dinesh says but actually it is the 4 only statement 2 is correct. Statement 1 is wrong. Less than 2% of the genome codes for proteins correct. Uh, next 42. It is from the Human Genome Project. Polymorphism in DNA sequence forms the basis of Yes, Dinesh, you are right. Both genetic mapping and DNA fingerprinting. Come to the 43. During density gradient, centrifugation small peaks formed are referred to as during the density gradient, centrifugation small peaks formed are referred to as satellite DNA or uh, genomic DNA or bulk DNA or both one and three. Yes, correct, Dinesh, and Nyanesh, uh, very correct. Come to the 43 question number. 43, the right answer is um, satellite DNA. Come to the 45. Yes, Nyanesh, very correct, 45. DNA fingerprinting involve following steps. Arrange them in a correct sequence. Isolating of DNA, correct. Immediately isolating of DNA, what they will do? The separate of DNA by gel electrophoresis or digestion of DNA by endonucleases. They cut the DNA into the fragments by using the endonucleases. AC. So automatically the next one step is Yes, Aparna Patipanda. She says uh, three. Very good. First one is A, next one is C. Automatically, the next step is the separation of DNA by gel electrophoresis and blotting, and the next hybridization by using the VNTR probe auto radiography. Next, come to the 45. Very good, Aparna. You are saying 45 4. Ganeshwari. Okay, very good. Satellite DNA. What is used as a probe? Satellite DNA. Here uh, we are using this uh, VNDR, bulk DNA, genomic DNA. Now come to the 46th question. This type of questions are more in the NEET examination. I think in 2023 NEET examination to kill your time. Okay, to overcome this. The strategy is you have to practice so many questions with, uh, with in a less time you have to complete the more questions with accuracy. So speed and accuracy you have to develop for that you should practice more and more number of questions. This type of questions are available in our app for free you can practice. Lacks of questions are there not thousands lacks of questions are available from the four subjects not only from the biology. In our app, physics, chemistry, botany, geology, four subjects, uh, grant tests and part tests are available in study material. Come to the 46th, the right answer is um, only B and C are correct. Euchromatin are lightly stained and transcriptionally active. And uh, frequency of crossing over is high in euchromatin. So next come to the 47th question. 47th question. Yes, Nyaneshwari, 46 too. Come to the 47. Only one strand of DNA is being copied during the transcription called template strand. Perfect. Everybody knows this. Right. Copying of both strands would prevent uh, translation of RNA into protein. Yes. Because of this only, only one strand is act like a template strand. If both strands would uh, translate automatically, that prevent the translation of RNA into the protein. 
so the right answer is given by the dinesh and gyaneshwari and aparna very good come to the 48 yes 48 transcription and translation could be coupled in history shakalai there is no well defined nucleus present in history shakalai that's why they are coupled both are correct and reason is also correct explanation excellent dinesh very good come to the 49th question and last but not least the 50th question 49 which of the following is not a goal of human genome project here it is the human genome project yes it is very easy and the students who are giving the answer for the question number 50 they will definitely get the good marks even though the answer is right or wrong and yes this uh, rule and tradition known by Jnaneshwari that's why she attempted the question number 50 first Wakajaki fragments are joined by enzyme ligase you said uh, sorry helicase you said no Jnaneshwari it is not helicase it is a ligase perfect and it is given by the Dinesh very good super Dinesh come to the 49th question Elimination of diseases is not a goal of human genome project. They don't want to eliminate the diseases. All diseases are not eliminated by the human genome project. Except the three, the remaining three are uh, goals of the human genome project. So this is about the today's session. Thank you so much for all the students. Dinesh, Aparna Patibanda and Gyaneshwari, Chandrika and uh, Badraksh. Yes, Vardhan and uh, for each and every student many many uh, very great thanks from my side heartful thanks for attending and make this session successful and tomorrow we will meet with uh, another chapter until see you have a nice day mostly the tomorrow session is morning 10 o'clock okay because sunday